Now let's run the program. Let's check the output of the program. In order to run the program, you can hit the function key F5 or click the green play button. So let's enter few random numbers separated by comma like 67, 89, 34, 12, 77, 45, 99, 123, 454, 23, 78 and hit the enter button and here you go so you can see the numbers are sorted correctly in ascending order this proves bubble sorting logics work perfectly hey guys you're watching coding science with the Tiksh. i'm a seventh grader studying in new jersey america and i'm based out of india in this video, I'll be talking about sorting algorithms in programming world. As you can see on the screen, few of them are bubble short, insertion short, selection short, heap short. Oof, there are so many. Anyways, today I'll be going through bubble short in detail with code demo and will cover other sorting algorithms in my upcoming videos. As the name suggests, in bubble short, all adjacent numbers are compared and lightened numbers bubbles up. Thus, heaviest number finds its correct position at the end of each pass. In order to avoid any confusion, just keep three things in mind for bubble short. A. Adjacent numbers are compared. B. Bubbles up lighter numbers. C. Correct position. Heaviest number finds its correct position after each pass. Alright, here I am using Microsoft Visual Studio to run my program. You can use any free tool available on internet to run yours. As you can see, this program starts with a namespace that contains a class called as program, having a main method. We'll know more about namespace and class in my upcoming videos. For today, let's focus only on the main method, which is the starting point of the code execution. Now, let's start this program with a comment program to sort a list of number using bubble sort. First, we will call method console dot right line to print please enter numbers you want to sort delimited by comma we will call same method one more time for formatting purpose let's declare a string called input and call console dot read line in order to read users input in string format now we will declare a string array called numbers and call input dot split method with a comma as a parameter to split the input string number into array in the next step we will simply convert string array into int array called input nums Next step, we will declare a temp variable of type int called as int temp with a default value of 0 for swapping purpose. Alright, before I move forward with the code implementation, I would like to explain the logic. We will need nested for loop to implement the logic. 
the outer for loop will decide number of paths required and it's equal one less than the total count of number to sort. So if there are 10 numbers to sort, there will be 9 paths in total. The inner loop will decide number of adjacent numbers comparison in each pass and it depends upon which pass the inner loop is for. As you can see on the screen, J will traverse till one less than count of the number minus I. This is because as I mentioned earlier at the end of each pass heaviest number finds its correct position. So if we do not do this count of numbers minus I the program will unnecessarily compare already sorted numbers and that will not be an efficient approach. Next we will write an if statement to compare the adjacent numbers and swap their position. If condition is met using a temp variable to correct the order of the number. This process is repeated until the entire array is sorted in an ascending order. Now we will write console.write line and write nothing which will output an empty line to the console creating a visual separation. Finally we will add few lines for formatting purpose. Keep in mind that there are more efficient sorting algorithms for larger datasets but bubble sort is a simple algorithm which is often used. Please let me know the city you are watching my videos from and give your thoughts on my videos for improvement in the future. At the end I would like to clarify that I have not covered any user input validation in my program, otherwise this video will be too long. Finally, we'll use console.writeLine method in a for loop to print the sorted number. Now let's run the program. Let's check the output of the program. In order to run the program, you can hit the function key F5 or click the green play button. So let's enter few random numbers separated by comma like 67, 89, 34, 12, 77, 45, 99, 123, 454, 23, 78 and hit the enter button and here you go so you can see the numbers are sorted correctly in ascending order this proves bubble sorting logics work perfectly please subscribe to my channel and show your support for more content like this meet you next video bye